Hi, I am Davina and this is Sarah Gorman. Hi. Uh, so Sarah and I have been training for four years together and we've been doing um, all kinds of classes together. We've done two DVDs with me. Um, she's beasted me. Um, she's amazing. She has her own sort of brand called Sarah Blenfit or Blenfit. And she's also a trainer on Annual Goals, which is my fitness platform. And we've just had the best time. Okay. Uh, I miss Sarah's classes so much, but the online classes, are, they're tidying me over, basically. <laughs> um, but will you just explain what we're going to do today? Yeah. I'm going to go get into position. So I've got you an exclusive 15 minute workout that is blend fit. So we're going to just mix things up. We're going to blend some things together. It's predominantly a strength training class um, and everything's going to flow from bit to bit to bit, but we will give you a few rest periods. Go at your own pace, obviously. And you're going to hear a little ping every now and again. And that's just a little key to remind you that you're going to change the exercise or maybe even change the position. But like I said, go at your own pace. Give it everything you've got. Main thing is to enjoy it, smile, and have a good time. Okay? Put on some tunes when you're doing as well. Okay. So coming up, we are going to start with a nice warm-up, simple warm-up to get the body moving, get the body warm. We're going to go into a dynamic cardio section. We're going to take it into a barless bar. So you're going to imagine you're at the bar for this little bit. You're going to get some glute and thigh fire action going. And then we're going to take it into a bit of a strength and core for the end. And finish with a nice gentle little stretch. I am so ready. I was born ready, Sarah. So. Okay. I am born ready. Let's do this. Let's do this. Okay. Warm up. All right. Standing with your feet nicely, just wider than hip width apart. Drawing in through the abdominals, lifting up through the pelvic floor, so you're drawing the sit bones inside the body, lifting the shoulders up, and then just dropping them down the spine. So those shoulder blades are really nice and rooted down the back. And let's lift them up for eight. Eight, and seven, and six. Drop them back. Five, and four, and three, Two, circle them back and one, one shoulder, single circle, drop it back, lift, drop it back, three and more of the body, four more, four, and three, and two, and one, and bring the arms up the top, and then just a gentle swing back, and lift them up, and a gentle swing back as we lift them up, shoulders drop down, lift them up, shoulders drop down, four more, four, lift, Back we go, and three, lift, back we go, and two, lift, and one, lift this time, we're gonna stand up to push, down to squat, up to push, down to squat, so this is more dynamic, we're lifting, and dropping down, lifting, weights in the heels, push, low, and push, low, four more, and three, and two, and one, drop, hold and pass. Two, three, four, weight in the heels. Pull it back, good, abs in, eight more, eight. And six, and four, and three, and two. Spread the legs out wide into second position. Second position plie, just make sure the knees are over the ankles. Nice gentle pulses for four, and three, and two, we're going to pick up the right heel for four, and three, and two, and one change over four, and three, and two, and one change over four, and three, and two, and one change over four, and three, and two, and alternate sides we change, change, change. Change, gentle change. Four more, count for four, three, two, one. Both heels go down, reach the arms forward, squat. Reach the arms open wide, reach them forward, squat. Reach them open wide, four more, four. And three, and two, and one. And hold here, bring the elbows back, lap hold, reach. Lap pull, reach, lat, 
reach. Now, single ones, we reach, we reach. And reach. And it doesn't matter which one you do first anyway. Two more, one. And two, last one. One and two. Now reach up. One, two, three, four more. Four, three, two, and one. Good, just circle the arms around. Reach them up and drop them down. Warm up is done. Good work. It's quite funny when you're, when you're thinking like the warm up's quite taxing. Yeah. I was like, this is the warm up. This is just the warm up. Okay, okay no, I'm fine. But the warm up has got to get you warm. The warm up's yes. got to get you yeah. going. It's got to get sweaty. It's not about stretching. Okay, so straight into the next one dynamic cardio. Stepping onto your mat. Okay, so this one, your feet are a little bit closer together. You're going to root back in those heels again. Drawing in through the abs, drop the ribs cage down, shoulder blades are down the spine. So we're coming into that deep squat, okay? Yeah. We're reaching forward of the body, okay? Try not to lean over. We're reaching forward for the floor. As you come up, you're going to go into a dynamic jump. Arms reach back. Down and reach. Up. Down and reach. Up. Down and reach. Up. Down and reach. Four. Three. Two. One. Now just the dynamic jumps. Reach down. Reach down. Faster. We go four more. Four. Three. Two. One. Hold it down. Jump out. And out. And out. And out. Four more. For four. And three. And two. And one. This time, roll down. Right bend of the knees. Out. Two. Three. Four. Two jumps. One. And two. Roll in. And then jump up. Reach down. Walking out. Two jumps. One. Two. In we go. Dynamic jump up. Good. Two jumps. One, two. In we go. Dynamic jump. Really push off from those heels. One, two. Let's come in. Reach up. And down we go. Jump, jump. In we go. Reach and down. Good. Jump, jump. In we come. Reach. We've got two more. Good. You've got this. Two, two. In. Reach, last one, and jump, jump, in you come, eight jumps, let's go, eight, six, five, four, three, two, one, middle jump out, one, two, one, three, four, four, three, two, one, good, take a rest. Oh, I thought you were never going to end it. I was like, this is the dynamic cardio version. No ending. I made Sarah go a bit slower with the walkouts because I can't go, but Sarah normally goes a bit faster than that. So if you feel like you can speed that section up, if you want, and similarly, you can slow it down. Absolutely. Whatever you Just whatever go you half pace if you need to ever go half pace. And if you're firing, I'll just really go for it and just really speed that through. I just want to say, it's like, it is amazing. Yeah. And then your heart rate's all right. Right, let's get on. So, this is your barless bar. Barless bar, okay? So, so we're gonna take it a little bit wider than you normally do. I really want you to think about lifting the inner arches of the feet up. So as we plie down, or bend down, think about drawing back with those inner thighs. We're really opening out with the inner thighs. And the weight is on the outside edge of the foot, coming into that heel, okay? Drawing in through the abs. Ribs are down, shoulder blades are down the spine. We're going to take the arms out, okay? So we're going to go a bit deeper into that plie, coming down, and then you're just going to come up to that three-quarter. So that's the burn. Down, reaching up into that three-quarter. Don't straighten up. Down, and reach. And down. And reach. Four more. And down. And reach. And down. And reach. Two more. And down. And reach. And down, and reach, hold here for pulse. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, peel the heels up and down, and up. We're just peeling the heels, lifting them up, off the floor, peel, resist the move. Four, and three, and two, and one, I want to lift the heels, hold, pulse, pulse, tiny pulses. Arms stay out. Four, three, 
two, same thing from the beginning. We're coming down, heels elevated, lift. Heels elevated, Woo! and if they stay up, legs should be shaking a little. Up, and down, and four, more. And foot, and lift, and three, and lift. Two more, down, and lift, and one, and lift. Heels down, we pass it down. This leg's coming up to an oblique crunch. Lift, push away, same leg. Lift, push away, again, lift, push away, again, lift, push away, four more, four, reach, three, reach, two, reach, one, change sides, lift, reach, lift, reach, lift, reach, four more, this side, pull, and pull, and pull, change sides again for four, four, Three, two, one, change sides for four, three, it does, two, one, this time step behind, curtsy squat, step it out, curtsy squat, and a step, two more, squat, step, now take it into a big crunch, and curtsy squat, lift, curtsy, lift, really drive up through the heel, Step it out, same side, same side. Curtsy, step, curtsy, step two more, curtsy, good, curtsy, curtsy, step, oblique crunch. Reach, really drive up through the heel, good. Activate through that glute, step it down, pull the heels together. Okay, arms still out, we're gonna raise. Ready, and eight, and six, and four, and three, and two, and one, stay up, heels together. Now squeeze those inner thighs together like you're holding a diamond between your thighs. Now come down, pinch those heels together, and plus. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, more, and eight, and six, and four, and three. Imagine your bars are there and coming down. Two, and lift. Don't stand up straight. That's the key. That's the fire. Down. And lift. And down. And lift. Two more. And down. And lift. And down. Now stay as low as you can. Lift those arms. Pulse. Eight. And six. And four. And three. And just for you, Davina, we lift. 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 lift, lift. Lift, can you travel down as you do it? Can you come back up as you go? One more, take it down. Two, three, four, and up. Two, three, four. Nice work. Okay, take a few seconds. Can I just put a big old rat uh, Sarah's hands? And <laughs> um, when she does that. I always want to be able to do that. Can she? <laughs> yeah, um, not you. I feel like such a class. <laughs> When I do bar with you, I'm so like heavy handed. Do you know what? It's really, it doesn't matter. The main thing is to lift from under here yeah. and feel like you're coming to an extension. It's just always feel like someone's pulling. I'm pulling your middle finger away. And that's that feeling of extension through the body. That's when it looks so pretty. Okay, moving on. Yeah. Strength four. Okay, let's come onto the mat. We're going to roll down into bear. It's one of my favourites. So, when you're rolling down, scooping those abdominals nicely in. Tailbone is heavy. We're tucking the chin to the chest. Tailbone is really nice and heavy. We're tucking the chin into the chest and rolling down the spine. We're taking it all the way, slightly softening the knees. Coming out, hands placed directly underneath the shoulders. My knees are about an inch or two inches off the floor. From here, I'm thinking of my butt going up to the sky a little bit and then pushing back into that down dog position. I put back into that bear position and then I'm gonna jump both feet to squat and lift the hands. Hands placed down, we jump back to bear. Push the dog, down to bear, push to squat. And down, bear, dog, bear, squat, lift and down, jump. Push, 
Fair, squat, good. Down, fair, push. Down, squat, again. Down, fair, push. Fair, squat, jump. Down, fair, push. Down, lift, jump, two more. Down, fair, push. Fair, lift, and one, two, three, four, hold. Stay low with jumping this way. Let's go. And two feet to two feet. Good. Now go back. Back, side, forward, back to the side. Side, back, side. Now go backwards, back, side, forward, and side. Yes. Oh, I was ready to go another Bring it on. Good work. Straight in. Drop down. Okay. Feet planted on the floor. Hands behind, fingertips towards the bottom. Open in the chest this time. Now, push the heels into the floor, okay? Think about the toes being lifted. They're not fully lifted, but I want you to think about them being light. Abs are in, push the hips up to the ceiling. Now, try and not grip in the front of the legs. Shoulders are down, create space away from the ears. Now, the hips dip down, they just kiss the mat, and then lift up to push. Kiss the mat, squeeze the glute to lift. Kiss, squeeze. Kiss, squeeze. Kiss, squeeze, kiss. Four more, and four. And three, and two, and one. This time hold it up, tricep dip. Down, lift. Try not to drop the bum completely. Don't let the shoulders hunch up by the ears. Elbows are traveling back, four. Three, two, one. We're going to put all that together. So we're going to kiss the floor with the bum, bring the knee up and bend the arms. One, push. Two, push. Three, push. Four, push. Four more, four. Three, use the glute. Use the hamstring, bring that leg down. Second leg. Pick the leg up, kiss the mat and push. Down. Down, down, four, knee, four, smile, three, and two, and one, push, down, thumb down. Let's flip around. Amazing, amazing for your triceps. So good for your triceps. Okay, here, you can stay on the, the length of your mat, which can come to the side. Elbow directly underneath the shoulder. Don't let it be out here. Don't tuck it under here. Hips. Stack them one on top of the other. Shoulder blades down. Lift this base oblique nice and high. What we don't want to do is collapse here. We're lifting. Create space between the shoulder and the ear. Now let's lift the obliques like someone's attached a hook to your hip, okay? That's the starter position. I'm pushing away. Arm comes up here, hold. Now lift that leg. As we extend out, the arm's gonna come up. As we pull down, the hip comes to the floor. Another kiss. Reach, kiss, reach, kiss, reach, kiss. Four more, and four. Push away, three. Push away, two. Push away, one. Hold it here, bend the knee, hands to the head. Now, curl around the front, knee to elbow. Reach it back, knee to elbow. Reach it back, knee to elbow. Reach it back, knee to elbow. Four more, four. Three, two, one, and then bring that knee down, gently lower the hip down, swing the knees to the other side. This is so good. It's so great for here, right? I can't believe it. Okay, so great for body positioning this one as well, because just in a kind of day-to-day -day environment, just thinking about drawing in through these muscles and thinking about where you're holding the body is great for you. So again, pick up that base oblique, Drop this shoulder away from the ear. Let's lift that arm up onto the side of the head. And then again, that little string that's lifting those hips up so you're not rocking forward or back. Let's lift that leg, keeping that base oblique up. And we stretch out and push away with that hand. Kissing the floor and down. Reach, down, and reach, down. Reach and down. Four more, four. Push, three. Push, two, push, one, 
Push, we're bringing that in and we're going elbow to knee. So we're coming around and back, around and back. Control, round and back and round and back. Four more, four, three, pop, two, and one. Hold that there, nicely bring the knee down, bring the hip down, and we're just gonna split the legs so that we're gonna come up into this nice four kind of position. Reaching the arms out in front of you, drawing in. Let's just go through a really simple stretch. So rolling the shoulders down, reaching through and out of those arms. We're just gonna lift up through the crown of the head and just turn the feet and roll to the back. We're gonna lift through. Trying to stay as upright as you can and lift through. And reaching around to the front again. And this time, as you come to the front, hands come to the floor, fold. Lifting up, arms extend to the back. Reaching down, arms forward. Oh, Lift. yes. So nice, right? And over. Oh. And lift. And over. Oh. And this last one, we're going to come up and around. We're going to bring it down. We're going to scoop the arm. Lift up and open. Lift up and open. Lift up and open. And lift up and open. And just so we're not facing the back, we're going to flip our legs around. There. And then we're going to scoop it around. Just so they can see what we're doing. Rich. And reach. Two more of these. Reach. And lift. And reach. And lift. So you see, strength training can be done in a beautiful, delicate format as well. I hope you enjoyed it. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it. Um, give it everything you've got and just remember to smile through all of your exercise. Thank you, Sarah. That was amazing. And you may have seen me grinning like a Tasha cat through that, but I actually genuinely find, because whenever you say smile, it does remind me that whatever I'm going through, even if it hurts, it's so good, it's for a purpose. Yeah. Even when it gets really, really hard, I do keep thinking that the big effort gets the big results. So it, the more it hurts, like the better it is. <laughs> so when Sarah says smile, I'm like, yes, come on, because, and I went on about this a lot, but I have never, ever, ever regretted a workout. I don't want to start, of course I don't want to. I was, you know, I'm never about seeing Sarah, she's so strong, she's so amazing. And I was thinking, oh God, I'm not gonna be able to do it. And now I've done it, I think I can do it. I can achieve more than I think I can. Yeah. And I think everybody has more in the tank than they think. So smile and just think at the end of this, I'm gonna feel so smug. <laughs> Um, like I do right now. <laughs> um, yeah, so try and sort of stay positive through your working out. And you will never ever regret a workout. And whatever you're doing, I've said this before as well, but you're always laughing everybody on the couch. So, if you like this workout, why don't you like and subscribe um, to Women's Health UK for lots more amazing workouts. But ours is the best of us. <laughs>